and then you choose to bat. Well, this just might be the exception to the rule. I think I'd have bowled first. It's a very grassy surface. You can see the tinges of green. You can feel and look at the damp in the pitch. It's going to nip around off the seam. Given the cloudy sky, it'll move in the air too. Oh, these are tough conditions. And against a quality bowling attack, I'm back in them. Clever batting, what smart thinking. He's picked a very safe area. What a super stroke. Do you know, I didn't think that was a bad ball either. Straight through the covers, the sweeper picks up. A hopeful shout, and the batsman was easily in. Beaten all ends up by that one. They were looking for that early wicket, and they're not disappointed. And the end of the over. They'll be looking to take full advantage of these fielding restrictions, so expect a wham, bam, and thank you, man sort of afternoon. The bowling side can now have up to five players outside the inner ring. Miles, he's in it, Miles! Pushing his luck a little there. That's two more runs on the board. appeal that that over helped the run rate somewhat don't even bother chasing that that's a way to the bleachers That was six all the way. Super catch that safely pouched by Collingwood. This was how the wicket fell. Gives easily back in the crease there. They've turned that into two, that's good running. Right, right, right. 
flawless, brilliant and maximum. It's high in the air. What a catch, what a catch. Collingwood is underneath it and takes it comfortably. by the man at long on. The field is appeal, but uh, he was quite comfortably home. He gave that a bit of Larry Dooley. and appeal there it goes oh dear that, that's a poor piece of fielding he seemed to take his eye off the ball Foolish running, that's simply throwing wickets away. Well, they got themselves in a right pickle out there, and look at the price they've paid. out for that one. by some margin. This is high quality cricket. I do it for the ladies. I gotta keep it hood. Hello again and the players and the umpires are making their way out to the middle after the break between the innings. We're ready now for the second session of play and with me commentating is Richie Bennett. This is Andrew Strauss. That's a big hit. It's six. Oh and the bowler can't believe it. That's out of the ground. Maximum. Terrible mess of the stumps, too. He is an exquisite cover driver. as you are ever likely to see. Bell is the next batsman in. He'll have enjoyed that. Perfectly timed and four from the moment it left the bat. Bowling there is that it's his favourite area and he'll hammer you every time. That's a great shot. Yeah. 
Bell moves into double figures with those runs. Oh, there's a demoralizing sight for any bowler. The ball is just sailing over the fence. And it's Marcus Triscothic on strike. Well, we'll see some fielding changes now that those restrictions are lifted. Remember that a minimum of four players have to remain inside the ring. You can't set fields for a shot like that. Brilliant! Be looking for that ball for days. He's always looking for that shot. It's such a strength in his game. He smashed that a long way. Done him. You know, he seemed to completely misjudge that ball and ended up just playing all around it. This was how the innings ended for Triscothi. Kevin Peterson takes guard. That really is a suicide run out. There might be a few heated words said about that in the dressing room too. Let's, uh... It's Andrew Flintoff on strike. Exciting, exciting player. There's risk in that stroke, but it is maximum. Turn that into two, that's good running. Bell waiting at the striker's end. is the next man in. Clinched victory here in this limited overs match. 